What's up everybody, guys? and Giddy Peak here, and I know what you might be thinking. You might be thinking, Jason, this song has been out for almost two weeks. Where have you been? I'll tell you where I've been. I've been here. I've just been busy. I've been doing my studies, you know, honestly, Japanese school and my studies occupy uh, the lion's share of my time. And then when I'm not doing that, I also have other shows and things that I'm checking out. Which is why I've only recently, as of yesterday, started Oshinoko Season 2. And how does that lead to this, you're, you're thinking, dear viewer? Well, most of you know that this is the opening theme for Season 2 of Oshinoko. It's called Fatal. It's by... Okay, here's where I'm going to butcher the pronunciation. Is it Gimin or is it just G-E-M-N? I I, this is the first time I've seen this name. I apologize. I am not trying to be funny at all. I just don't know how to pronounce it. If you know, please help me out in the comments. And it is my understanding that this is a duo comprised of Tatsuya Kitani, who we have definitely checked out on the channel before. Uh, I think most recently it was Where Our Blue Is, which was from Jujutsu Kaisen. Obviously, I'm a huge fan of that show. It's a great song. And Kinto Nakajima, I want to say. And again, please forgive me. I have never heard of Kinto Nakajima. Feel free to educate me on this individual in the comments. I, of course, I always want to learn more about these artists. Uh, but yes, going back to the original point of the story, I only recently started Oshinoko season two as of yesterday uh, and kind of heard this song a little bit but i wanted to skip it because i knew i was going to do this reaction if that makes sense and i wanted to experience the video and the song together as a package that tends to be how i roll in case you didn't know i'm also going to be checking out the hitsuji bungoku song burning which is the ending theme for oshinoko so of course look for that again i've only heard a small part of that now obviously the the bar for opening theme songs involving Oshinoko has been set unrealistically high by Yoasobi, an idol. So it would be foolish to assume that this song would reach those great heights. That that song was sort of like lightning in a bottle. It's, it's just probably not going to happen again for a while. However, I'm willing to give this a fair shake. Of course, I want it to be a good song. I want it to be like all good anime opening themes where you just want to watch the anime opening because it's that good. You don't want to you don't want to hit skip intro if you get what I mean. So let's see what Fatal is all about. It's my boy. Why the switch up? I'm looking. Oreo as well? Oh, that's fun. I, I can't do it. F yeah, Fatal. Like Femme Fatal? But it says Fatal? Huh. Who's right and who's wrong here? We're going with the song. It's Fatal. Gun imagery? She 
It is fatal. The change-ups are nuts in this. This is cohesive chaos. Oh, he put the gun to his head via K Tide. Huh? What the hell? Disney Plus with the super quick ad? Uh, wow. Okay, yes, like I was saying uh, during the video, that is what I would call uh, cohesive chaos as a song. Like, it feels like it's all over the place, it feels super spastic, but yet it's still very coherent. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm also thinking of it in the context of an anime opening, and of course it fits the bill. It's got the energy, it's got a great modern sound, um, it's one of those tracks that I feel like could definitely appeal to a global audience. Um, I still don't know how to pronounce the group name, the duo name. Uh, have they been a duo for a long time, or, or is this a new creation? Again, let me know. Wow, there was a lot going on in the video too. A lot of choreo, a lot of interpretive dance, uh, a lot of glitter, a lot of handguns. It's not bad. I don't know that it is good enough for me to not want to skip it. Again, I told you at the beginning of the video, that's sort of how I evaluate an opening anime theme. The song, the video, is it good enough for me to want to hear it every time I start a new episode? I'm not sure about this one. It's not bad. It's just not necessarily my style, but I would love to hear your thoughts on this down in the comments below. Of course, do you love it? How does it stack up with Idol? I mean, it's sort of an unfair comparison because like I said, that was really like a global phenomenon of a track, but hey, maybe this is more your style. Regardless, is this a skippable intro to you? Or are you going to be rocking with this every time you watch a new episode of Oshinoko? Let me know. But as always, thank you so much for helping my small channel grow. Thank you for watching this video. And I will catch you in the next one.